Welcome to the Wildlife and Fisheries Research and Education Facility. This provides a controlled outdoor environment in which to conduct wildlife and fisheries research, but it also provides a tremendous outdoor laboratory for training of students as well as educational tours. The Wildlife and Fisheries Research and Education Facility hosts numerous tours each year. An outdoor aviary has recently been renovated. This facility houses a captive breeding population of 250 wild strain bobwhite. This aviary also is designed to enable research on quail, waterfowl, wild turkey, and other birds. Established in 1982, the Captive Carnivore Unit is the only facility in the world with a captive breeding population of bobcats. It occupies over 28,000 square feet and also houses a black bear, cougar, otter, raccoon, and foxes for educational and research purposes. The Captive Deer Facility was established in 1978 and was renamed the Johnny R. Rusty Dawkins Memorial Deer Unit in 2003. This facility encompasses approximately 11 acres and can support a population of 150 deer although the annual average is around 100 deer. The facility has allowed research on deer genetics, fraternity, and antler growth and development. The South Farm Aquaculture Research Facility consists of over 90 ponds ranging from one-tenth to one-quarter acre and a fish holding facility. Here, faculty, students, and staff research hatchery procedures for different species of fish. Researchers also manipulate fisheries habitats to reintroduce threatened species to their native waters and determine how different catching methods influence the population of fisheries. In addition to these on-campus activities, scientists work with numerous landowners to conduct research studies on waterfowl habitat, fisheries, quail habitat, endangered species, and predator impacts. Researchers travel throughout the southeast to work with various landowners, organizations, and others.